Are you tired of Fortnite lagging and stuttering on your low-end PC? In this video I'm gonna show you how I unlocked 240 plus frames per second on an ultra low-end PC, using some game-changing tweaks, so stay tuned and let's get your FPS boosted in no time. Gira Booster is one of the best program for the optimization of your ping while you play games, using your wired or wireless connection, so get this paid program free from my description, and play your game with lower ping. So, for your window mode, you want to make sure that you're on full screen, if you're playing on native. Anyways, you want to make sure that your V-Sync is turned off, nobody even uses it. You want to make sure that your frame rate limit is capped to your monitor's refresh rate, so for me it's going to be 144. To then you want to make sure that your rendering mode is on performance mode, your graphics is personal preference but I do have it on 125 brightness at Triton 8. You want to make sure that your 3D resolution is anywhere between 75 to 85 percent. This will actually boost your FPS a lot because when you tune your 3D resolution a little bit down you're going to be rendering a less pixels which results in more FPS and less input delay. But for me I like my game to look good so I usually have it on 90%. Then for your view distance it does not really impact your FPS that much so I'm going to keep it on far. Then you want to make sure that your textures are on low and your meshes on low as well. So you want to go ahead and download the FPS boost pack and extract it. You can get this file from my official website I give link in the description. This will drastically improve your FPS, as well as fix all your FPS drops. Anyways, you wanna go ahead and click on the Ultimate Performance Power Plan. What this will do, it's basically going to enable the Ultimate Performance Power Plan. As you guys can see, the Ultimate Performance Power Plan is now enabled. So, you wanna head over to your Power Options, and you wanna go ahead and click on Power Options right here. And as you guys can see, ultimate performance is right there, so you want to go ahead and select that. This ultimate performance power plan will basically utilize power on your system in order to improve performance on your PC. Next, you will find out MSI Tuesday through the help of optimizing our GPU, what I would that is a low-end GPU or a high-end GPU. You can get this file from my official website, I give link in the description. So now as you open up the MSR, you need to go for your GP model that, whatever that is, I have the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 70D. You need to go for it, go for this drop down and set it under the high purity. After that, pick on supplier button and simply close out your MSI and you can also delete this application from your PC. Hey guys, now I'm going to recommend you Gear Up Booster, which you can grab for free using the link in the description. Just launch the tool, select Fortnite, and it will automatically connect you to the most optimal server for the lowest possible ping. As an example, I've managed to reduce my latency by 11 milliseconds, which has improved my overall performance by more than 100%. I've been using this for all the games I play on my PC, so be sure to check it out using the link in the description. Then you wanna head back over to the FPS Boost Tag, you can get this file from my official website, I give link in the description. Now you have the RAM tweaks, so you want to go ahead and select the amount of RAM you have, and you want to go ahead and double click, and click on yes, then ok. What this will do is basically going to apply some RAM tweak, so basically it's going to edit your registry files in order to improve your RAM. Now on the next step, here we go to this NVIDIA potato graphics, this can only work with the NVIDIA, inside you will find that NVIDIA profile inspector with the UTI file. And here you will find the Fortnite pair of settings, this is for you to find settings for the application. So that is simply tap up the appeal. Hit yes. As well as you should go for this profile option, go for a Fortnite, and open up the Fortnite profile inside the Media Profile Inspector. I want to go for this import button, import either defined, import profile, and go for it, and becomes open button, and profile, such as for the imported. Now hit OK and it's with accurate of like, all the best settings for you. After then you get now click on apply jeans button and apply the settings on your PC. I love you want to leave all the settings back to the normal so here you will find out this option that is the restore run profile to when we get default. So click on this button and restore all the settings back to the normal then hit apply and save the settings. Alright guys then we're going to be optimizing some window settings. They're really really simple but they do impact your game a lot and the first thing is quite obvious which is the game mode. Now guys, this is such a simple and easy setting, but trust me guys, it impacts your performance a lot, so you want to make sure to have game mode on if you're on Windows 11, but if you're on Windows 10, then make sure that you keep this off. The reason why is because game mode is more optimized on Windows 11. Then you want to head over to graphics right here, 
Then you want to make sure to have hardware accelerated GPU scheduling turned on because as anyways you want to head back over to graphics and you want to search for custom options for apps relied on in on browse. Once you click on browse you want to locate your Fortnite folder is basically going to be in Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, Win64. And you want to make sure to click on Fortnite client Win64 shipping. I already have it. Anyways, once you do it, you're going to find it right here. And you want to go ahead and click on options and make sure to click on high performance. This will once again utilize the full performance of your GPU in order to get better performance. Anyways, you want to go ahead and click on say 